Sharon's voice is one of those voices that just goes right to your soul. It's arguably the most beautiful voice that anybody will ever hear. And that voice, you know, that voice. Perfection is just about impossible, but that's always in my mind, you know. There was a very loving, happy part to her, and then there was a kind of a, a darkness there. There's no way to be able to handle that kind of success. There was something about her that she didn't like about herself. I had no idea that I could do a blasted thing. She definitely battled her self-image. She never had a successful romantic relationship. Love is something that I think everybody in this world has to have, and without it, you're not worth anything. She was a very sensitive human being, and she was incredibly injured. No one really knew a lot about anorexia back then. It wasn't something that was really talked about. When I got sick, it scared the hell out of me, man. I was like, whoa, down to the old 89 pounds there. My God, Karen, what did you do to yourself? You don't really know when you step over that line. How were you born with that kind of talent, that extraordinary genius talent, and then sabotage yourself? Maybe she never wanted fame. Perfection is a battle that you'll never win. You could have fame and the most beautiful voice in the world and still feel a hell inside. I don't think Karen Carpenter's true story has really been told. You can't stop. The yeah, only way so. you can stop is die. We've only just begun to live.